Hi, I'm Kevin with DSLR Pros. Today, I'm gonna to be showing you how to update the firmware of your Teledyne FLIR Cyrus. First, start by removing the micro SD card from the remote controller and place it in the card reader of your computer. Use the firmware download link provided by your dealer to download the Cyrus APK firmware file and copy it into the root directory of the micro SD card. Insert the micro SD card back into the controller. Now, turn on the controller, then the airframe, and wait for them to connect. Close the Cyrus app by swiping left from the right edge of the screen, tap the square, then swipe up in the middle of the screen. From the desktop, open the file manager. Tap the three bars on the top left of the file manager window, and then tap on the micro SD card. If a folder called Cyrus is present, remove it by tapping on the square to the left of the folder icon, then tap the three dots in the upper right hand corner, select delete selection, then tap yes to confirm. Next, tap the Cyrus APK file to run the installer. Once the option becomes available, tap install, then wait for the installation to finish. Once complete, press the open button to start the Cyrus app. When the Cyrus app opens, it will check for the latest version of firmware. When you are notified of the new firmware, press update and wait for the process to complete. After the firmware installation is complete, restart the controller and then the airframe. To check the firmware version, wait for the Cyrus app to open and for the controller and airframe to connect. In the settings menu, go to the about section, which will show you that your Teledyne FLIR Cyrus has been updated to the latest version. That's it for now. If you have any questions about the Cyrus, give us a call, email us, or visit our website at dslrpros.com. Thanks for tuning in, and we'll see you next time.